This is John Norm from the band Europe, and um, I'm going to show you some licks and some uh, riffs from some old and new songs, and I hope you enjoy it. Have a good time. Uh, we got a new album out right now called Last Look at Eden, and uh, it's a really good album, I think, and got some really you know, exciting songs and some really good guitar playing on there and some great vocals and stuff. And also I have a new solo album out at the moment called um, Play Your Blues. And uh, you know, it has a lot of exciting uh, guitar stuff on there. And uh, it's more kind of towards, it's a little different to the Europe stuff. It's more kind of like blues rock type of stuff. And uh, but uh, go check it out. I think it's a really good album, and uh, you know, got some great, exciting guitar playing on there. So check it out, and hope you enjoy it. Take care.
This is a Gibson Les Paul standard. This particular one is a Warren Haynes uh, signature model. This is really good. And it has a coil tap here to get a single coil sound. And uh, it has um, Seymour Duncan pickups, Antiquity. Uh, they're not the real original pickups. The original pickups were burst buckers one and two, and so. But I like these ones better. And otherwise, uh, the only thing that that I do is that I put a wrap the string around the tailpiece, you know, because it gives it, you know, it gets l less tension on the strings. You know. They don't, and they don't break that often either, you know, when you do that. And then uh, the amps that I use on this particular video here or DVD is um, a Marshall. JMD, JMD. You know, this is not really my stuff, so I'm just borrowing this stuff. And uh, but it's the latest uh, Marshall amp that's out now. And it's quite good. You get like a bunch of built-in effects and things like that, which are really cool, you know. And then it's a Marshall cabinet that goes with it, you know. And uh, the Gibson Les Paul and the Marshall combination is, you know, it's unbeatable, the greatest sound of all time. Thank you very much. some playing tips um, I think it's important you just kind of 
you know, just keep at it all the time, you know. I've noticed with myself when I don't, like, haven't played for a few days, it kind of goes down the drain kind of fast, you know. So I think it's very important to, you know, keep practicing every day, and, you know, as much as possible, whenever you have the time, you know, also. And um, other things are kind of like listen to your records, listen to your favorite players, and try to play along to the albums and stuff like that. That's what I used to do when I grew up. I used to play along to a lot of the Jimi Hendrix stuff and UFO stuff and um, early like Eric Clapton and Blues Breakers and stuff like that. And, you know, I was very ambitious at the time. And, uh, you know, I just kept, you know, recording stuff down on tape and then kind of slowing the tape down and try to, you know, figure out the stuff that those guys were doing. And, so I think that's a you know good way to start you know getting into then getting started to learn licks and stuff like that then it gets very exciting then you just want to continue playing so so go ahead and, and listen to your favorite guitar players learn what you can from them and then try to you know develop your own style which I think is very important too all right take care.